What's going on guys, Sub right here, and I've been thinking of a way to introduce myself to start this video out. And look, this is a long ass video. 10 minutes is an eternity for me to talk. I typically only do 4 or 5 minute commentaries, but this is a long video and it's not something you can really cut apart. So I've been worried about how to start this intro. The real thing I should be worried about is getting 9 minutes in and completely fucking the thing up. And having to redo it over and over and over. So as I said, my name is Subright. And this is actually my second time uploading to PwnStars.com's channel. And it's a huge opportunity. I really appreciate it. Uh, typically, bigger YouTubers... I mean, he's not huge, but bigger YouTubers don't help out that often for smaller commentators like myself. But PwnStars is, is one of the few people that will upload a, a smaller channel's commentary nearly every week, if not two for each week. So I went back and watched my last video um, of <laughs> that I uploaded, which was in May. And let me tell you, the commentary was horrendous. If you guys want to go check it out, I'm sure PwnStars will uh, put it in the description. But it, it was horrendous, and I've really worked on my commentary... Com commentary? Commentating skills. Wow, that just fucked up right there but I've really worked on them and I think I still have a lot of room to improve the enthusiasm in my voice I was a very shy uh, introverted person and I've worked really hard to keep that out of my commentaries because no one wants to hear me mumble on on and on about a gameplay when they can just mute it listen to some music or find someone else talking about the exact same thing so enough about that. Uh, the gameplay it actually is the world's first triple free-for-all win. A lot of you guys are probably really confused. Um, how do you win? How do you get a triple free-for-all win? Uh, you could typically only get 30 kills in a free-for-all and then it's over. So a lot like the double free-for-all mob that Pwn Stars uploaded to Wicked Shrapnel's channel, I get to 29 kills, I back out, and I get back in. Only this time, I get to 29 kills again, back out, get back in, and then get 30 kills. So in total, I get 88 kills in a 10-minute span against the same people in the same lobby. Now, a lot of you probably don't think that's too impressive because I'm using air support, and obviously the enemies are noobs. They suck ass. They're, they're, just, they're just the worst players in Call of Duty, and that's probably true. I'm not going to get this kind of gameplay against uh, four or five KD rushers like Pwn Stars. It's, ju it's just not going to happen. The best gameplays you see on YouTube are against the worst players. If That's why Black Ops 2 is in implementing a skill-based matchmaking, I guess, to see how we do against people of our own skill while, while you can still go out and get beast gameplays against the worst players in Call of Duty. So before you go into the comment section saying, oh, you, f you fucking suck. You're not really that good. You you just played against the worst players. I, I fucking know <laughs> these aren't the best players. And I never once said that these are the best players. I never said I was the most amazing player out there. I am a good player. I've been told over and over I'm, I'm above average in free-for-all. Uh, and don't, don't worry. I'm not letting this go to my head. So the first thing I want to talk about is my channel. What do I upload to my channel? I typically upload free-for-all. I'm a huge free-for-all player. Uh, I love free-for-all. I don't have to rely on retarded teammates to help me out, capture a flag, or get kills. When I play solo TDM, I can usually carry my team, but every so often I drop 40 plus kills and we still lose, and I just, I just hate that. So typically you're going to see free-for-all from me, free-for-all moabs, free, assault free-for-alls. Uh, since we're coming to the end of Modern Warfare 3, I've been uploading a lot more Assault because that's what I enjoy playing with. And I enjoy playing with MP7, P90, all the overpowered shit you guys, you guys like to complain about. But I'm over it. I'm not gonna run around with a pistol blindfolded just for you guys' entertainment because you think I'm some scrub kid that can't play unless I'm using the most overpowered shit. It's, it, that's just not the case. So... The reason I started YouTube in the very beginning was to help myself with talking to people. I, I typically have a problem. I, I'm not a very social person, I should say. I don't know if you guys can tell through my commentary. I've worked really hard to work on that. But I typically don't like talking to people. I like keeping to myself. I'm a very private and quiet person. 
So I started YouTube to meet some people. Uh, I've been watching like Woody's Gamer Tag, Xjaws, White Boy. A lot of the people I don't watch anymore. I still watch Woody. But I watched them. I looked at how much fun they were having. I didn't think you could have that much fun over the internet. I, I never knew about it. So I started YouTube to meet people and to have people like my gameplays. I, I wasn't the best when I first started. If you go back and watch some of my older gameplays, you will see that I am uh, was pretty bad. When I started Black Ops, I was a 0 .6, 0 .7 KD player. And even in Modern Warfare 3, at the very, even when I started my channel in January, I was a 1.6, 1.7 KD player. And now up towards the end of Modern Warfare 3, now I've gotten a, a feel for it and I've practiced. I've put in 35 days into this game. I better be good at it. I can hold a 3 to 4 KD rushing. Even though my overall KD is pretty bad, it's because I have so many kills. It's hard to raise a KD when you have 100,000 plus kills. But anyways, that's why I started my channel, and one of the things I hope to achieve in this next year, I kind of got into the YouTube scene really late, even for Modern Warfare 3. Uh, January was really late to start and to really grow. And I really would like to reach 10k subs by the end of Black Ops 2. I know that seems like a lot now. I'm at 1,500, and I, I, don't, I don't know if that's possible, and I think with your guys' help, it can be. With help from people like Pwn Stars, I, I know it's possible. I've gotten attention from some of the other bigger commentators like Green Goblin and Refresh HD and Wicked Shrapnel even, even likes some of my videos. Uh, it probably has to do with that I'm in the Wicked Elite. But I, I really appreciate any help you guys can offer me. And 10k subs by the end of Black Ops 2 would be huge for me. So that's it for my channel, and I do live stream. I don't stream in the same quality as Pwn Stars does. Uh, I can't stream in 720p. I, I have a 4 megabyte download and a 0.6 upload, so you can imagine how frustrating it is to stream and play on a 2 bar. So I, I'm pretty sure my stream is 360p. I currently have 600 plus followers, I believe, almost 700. And I've worked really hard to gain those followers. I I try to pull out the beast beast gameplays for you guys while streaming, which is not always possible. Um, for even Postars, he said when he's streaming, his connection is iffy, and he has a beast connection compared to me. So if you guys want to go ahead and go over and check out my live stream, I'd really appreciate that. Uh, I I stream nearly every day for a few hours, so. You, if you guys will always have me to watch if you if some of your favorite streamers aren't on hopefully I become one of your favorite streamers and I actually planned on doing a 24-hour live stream this weekend I don't I'm pretty sure this is going up Sunday but I'll be doing it the first week of November because some of the other bigger streamers are doing 24-hour streams and I'm just not gonna get any followers or viewers when they're streaming so that's pretty much it, guys. I, uh, if you guys pay attention to the gameplay, if you've stuck around this long, I really appreciate if you guys go check out my channel. I've re This is really hard to keep up the energy for a 10-minute commentary. I am typically just kind of ramble on when I do my commentaries, but I figured if I'm uploading to someone else's channel, I have to keep it specific, and I have to keep the energy up, and I have to keep you guys entertained for the entire time, or you're just going to say, this guy's stupid, I'm clicking away. Uh, I really appreciate you guys watching this, and I really, you guys have no idea how much I appreciate Pwnstars uploading this to his channel. This wasn't an easy gameplay to get. As you can see, it was really intense towards the end, and this was on my live stream, so the connection wasn't the best. But I, I believe I get like 19 kills in the span of 50 seconds thanks to my air support. I will be going for some triple free-for-all wins with Specialist and even 100 plus free-for-all with Assault um, before Black Ops 2 comes out. And I have some amazing things planned for Black Ops. Me and Pwn Stars are going to be playing a lot together. I'll be uploading some gameplays where we play together. Uh, a lot of you already probably already know who I am, so you guys probably stuck around just because you like, like, like hearing me talk and are already subbed to me. But that's pretty much it, guys. I'll let you guys finish the gameplay and enjoy it. And don't forget to come check me out and like the video it even if you didn't like me like the video because it's Pwn Stars channel and it helps him out I, I I can't say how much I appreciate it and I hope I didn't butcher this commentary too bad and 
that's pretty much it. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.